Weed of the Week is a cool season perennial. It's yellow wood sorrel. Otherwise known as oxalis, and this is one of those weeds that I used to see in my lawn, and I would think, oh no, I've got a clover out there. Well, it looks a lot like clover, but it's just a little bit different. It's got trifoliates with heart-shaped leaves, and it's got five-petaled yellow flowers. Okay, this is a cool season weed, so that means it's going to get going early in the spring. Well, how are you gonna stop it early in the spring? If you're in a lawn, Pendimethalin is probably the product that I would use. Now there are many herbicides that will actually give you some activity on this. We talk quite often about Drive or Quinclorac, that can work as well. Out in crop fields, I'm not really too worried about it. We got plenty of herbicides that will control this and even just cultural practices are fine because once your crop gets up, this weed doesn't grow tall so you a lot of times can choke it out. The pre-emerge herbicides do work fairly well though if we're using our three pre strategy in soybeans where we've got one of the yellows in there like a pendimethalin for example or a trifluralin. or trifluralin and then also the sulfentrazone, valor, I, I mean so authority, valor, they'll, they'll all work fine and so again three pre's in soybeans. In corn I'd probably want something with sharpened down, same thing in wheat, sharpened down. Then if you start talking post-emerge it's not that difficult to control. In the non-crop areas Triclopyr is really good. Roundup will certainly kill it. Liberty will give you a decent suppression. Dicamba, 2,4-D will be okay. You just have to use high rates of dicamba and 2,4-D. Yeah, wide match would be a good choice for you in wheat as well. That's all the time we have for our Weed of the Week Yellow Wood Sorrel, but Iron Talk is coming up next.